Welcome back, everybody. So let's see about finishing up here. So I want to put in a little landscaping here so it looks better. Since it looks kind of plain and sloppy, I'm going to unplain and sloppify, unsloppify. And the path block is good because no snow. So I like that. I just wish uh, there was a way to permanently no snow if I stay. But I sound like a broken record. I always complain about the snow. Which means I need to get the heck out of this snow area and stop building there for a while. Because uh, maybe pick a nice jungle or desert. Maybe I should go try and find a desert and that will be my next renovation set up a desert uh, outpost. And that torch didn't even melt that snow is right next to it. That's, that's pitiful. So let's see. I have some trees. I think I'm going to put a tree here. They gave me some rooted dirt. Let's do that. Um, that kind of covers up a lot of that too, doesn't it? Maybe a tree here. Oh, come on. I know you can grow, grow. There you go. Maybe one here, like th there. This might actually turn out not bad. It's a glow lichen. I'm gonna put some regular, regular uh, vines on here. There. Maybe a bush. Couple of these bushes look nice. Some bamboo. Let's see some more. This glow lichen. I don't think it's going to spread though. So there. Let's see. And over here, do you think I can get another tree in? I don't know. And I think it's going to run up against against that. So I'm just going to bone mill it. Oh yeah, I've got a few of these funny dead plants. Oh, and some berries. There we go. This corner needs something. Um, I don't think I've got it in my inventory though. I almost want a tree here, but maybe just some bushes. I wonder if I've got any leaves. Come on, I hope I have leaves. Look how chest monstery this got. I've got it keeps expanding it more and more chests, and it's just like gonna fill up pretty soon. Maybe like that, and then since I'm here, slap some greenery on it like that. I'll even do this. Maybe that'll keep the snow off of that part. That tree grew really fast. Look how big that is compared to the other one. So now, I guess we're going to need to work on these stairs here. First up, I need to go up there and dig down probably two layers. So this would be the wall here. 
So stairs up. So I need, yeah, I need to down like too thick on that one. Okay, I've cleared out and pushed this wall back. So now we have room to put our stairs here. And they've got extra room. So I can put a wall on top. There we go. Like this. There, and then you get up here to this point. There. Oops. Well, that's not going to work. So I know this has to go all the way up. Boy, this is a long way. This is going to be a tall, tall wall. Dang it. Can I reach that? No. No. I can't tell can't tell how close that is. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure if it was on the right level or not. So we'll have that wall there. And then this. Well, hopefully this is the same level. I think that was why I didn't fill this in because I thought it might be at a different level. And I was right, of course. So now I'm going to have to pull this all out again. And we're going to have to go down there and get those blocks. So I had to carve out a lot more of this hill than I thought. Let's see. And this is up a little too high, maybe. Well, no, I think it'll be okay. Right here. So the tunnel is going to go somewhere, somewhere in that direction. I may actually probably center it over here someplace. Because this will be the wall. So maybe here and. Make the tunnel one, two, three, three wide. Then we'll, yeah, curve, curve the entrance like that. I may even do this. I do here. Something like that. And I did bring some wall pieces. Now let's take that out and put in a torch there just to get some lighting. Oh, um, Bricks, bricks, those bricks. How come the odds are you get flint whenever you break gravel? I mean, it seems to be more flinty than non-flinty. There. At least I got an entrance to the tunnel, so I'm just going to have to dig the tunnel out. Let's see. Through here, we can just do that. And I guess this is going to have to go all the way up there, too. Because this wall is going to be all the way up at the top there, I think. Unless I drop it down a level. I have to go up there and see. Really, I need to clear out all those trees. So I have to clear out all those trees and I have to clear out all the trees over here. So, so 
So let's see what we got here. I've got a few different types of wall. So let's do that. There. Yeah, so just kind of go with a little, uh, some kind of random design. Which I've been trying to do on the walls, because I don't want to make them just flat, one-dimensional. So I think having all this in there, and even maybe sticking in some different types of blocks through here. Like kind of hardlining it with um, just some normal blocks will do. Maybe even something like that. And then we can fill it in here. Let's see. Well, that won't work. I'm going to have to put a solid block behind all those stairs. But luckily, I have to clear out all this because I need to make a path and a kind of a, not courtyard, but a, what do you call that? Not plaza, but just a little flower garden maybe or something here. Just some greenery. So it goes this way. The greenery will be here. And this path is going to go all the way around. So I thought it'd be good to have at least one path so you could, you know, get around the, the whole, you know, hill from this level. Clear out all this. Something like that. That way we can put solid behind that. And yeah, I'm going to put this here. And did I bring? Yes, I did brought stone brick. So I got some uh, spruce fence. It goes right here. I guess these two come up. Oh, no. there I lost some uh, some dirt but I think I'm okay I should really make this a top sl half slab but I don't like the elevation here I mean if this one up one but I think it I think it looked a little weird if this whole thing was one. That transition from the stairs isn't smooth. At least not smooth like I would like it to be. It's a little too close to the tunnel entrance too. And this is going to be a narrow, just two strip with plants on that side. Yeah, because the wall has to go this way. So we need... we'll just have to extend the wall out all the way out here. I still haven't figured out what elevation this is going to be, so I don't know how tall this wall is or where it needs to end. I really have a feeling it's going to end right, right here. So, like, that'll be the end of the wall. So, we put the cobble in. Well, that doesn't work either because you can see that torch. I'm going to have to do that. Maybe the lighting. Oh, good. Okay. I do have lighting behind there, so that'll be okay. There. Something like that. Holy cow. What are you doing in there? Get out. 
stupid Enderman. I'm going to have to go in there and get rid of it now. There we go. Up, over, down. Go away. I love how the anger, angry sound continues to play after you've killed them. Well, I, should call, I should probably put something on top there. Look at that. That's got snow on it. Maybe some brown carpeting because I think that's spruce. Yeah, it's spruce. So if I put some brown carpeting on there, it might not look too bad. Or maybe just some spruce. Uh, what are those? Pressure plates? Or even uh, buttons. Spruce buttons may work. So where were we? Oh, I was up here working on the wall. I had to go down and get more supplies. And heard that stupid Enderman. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do this today. Maybe next episode. Or maybe I'll clear out there and we'll fix the road next episode. Haven't, haven't fully decided on what I'm going to do. Except I am going to finish this wall. Although I'm still not sure exactly how far it's going to go. So I'm only going to go over the, this over here someplace. And I do want, I want to put some lights in here. Because it doesn't hurt to have lights. Let's see if I do. I'm going to just fill in this all that oops where the hell what the there's a hole there I didn't realize that there we go get that hole out of there oh I need to finish this wall too what do I want to do on this one I've got more of this cobbled deep slate so what if I put so this is like a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that's good. So then I can do, if I do this, and, um, da -da. there, like that. Yeah, how about that? And then maybe, Oh no. Oh, there we go. They're like, how did I run out of bricks? Okay, that looks good. Um, yeah, and then the rest of it, you can just do the stone brick. Oh, what's that just so I have a little bit of light even if it's not going to really light up anything I think it looks better when you when you can actually see um, see the light through the through the walls these up so we got our little path here and then up here let's do oops that maybe something like that and then maybe There. Okay, that's looking pretty good. I just, I'm going to have to push that up. I'm still not sure if the level is going to be a 
that height way up there or down here a little bit and on this side I'm not sure I know I'm going to go all the way around here I need to take out that tree and build this up and build the wall up as below there but I'm not sure about this level there may be a level here and then stairs leading up to that level and then more stairs leading up to that level because this is such you know just trying to get the multi-tier in here so I'm not going to be able to put a top on here until I figure it out and that's going to involve getting rid of all those trees which will be in the next couple episodes later on or maybe off camera so you don't have to worry about that now I do want to just finish up around here by putting in some trees and bushes and stuff and do I have dirt? Yeah, I do have dirt. So like here, let's do, we just put a tree here, like that. There, and let's do this. Put a little bit of glowberry on that. Stack up some of these like that. Let's see. Is that there? Let's do that. Oops, not that. What about that? I'm going to put that. And I do have one moss, so let's just put that there. So that takes care of that. And then over here, let's put a tree right here. Oh, that was quick. I was waiting for that to uh, take three or four bone meals, but get rid of that. Let's do, there we go, that, there, there, like that. And we'll do our glowberries. Actually, yeah, I can grow these all the way down too. And then we'll just light that up. Because it's so easy, you just do this and you get lots of lots of glowberries. So it's almost uh, just as easy to or actually easier to build it all the way as long as you want rather than uh, wait for it to grow. That I'm not getting any flowers or anything, am I? Yeah, I'm just getting weeds. Weeds, weeds, weeds. Lots of weeds. Oh, there's a flower right there. And then here. Uh, yeah, I'll put these here. Those might, they might get out of control and be too high. But I think they'll be okay. Oh, I, I, that does open me up over here. I can do this. Because I've got trees going all the way to that wall. Which is actually a good thing. Because that wall was a little too flat. I mean, it's got the design and everything on it, but it was, I was wondering if I need to put fake windows or, or shutters or something on there. But now that I've got the trees in the way, uh, that actually doesn't look too bad then. It doesn't look as uh, boring and uh, flat. Do that. I didn't need to do those down below because I'm going to have land over it. But, uh, I think that is going to take care of this part for today. I'll continue on working through here once I figure out what am I going to do the tunnel or am I going to go around here and clear things out. So, um, either way, I need to do both. So someday, sometime, you're going to see that. For now, I want to wish you all a very uh, good day uh, and hope to see you later. Bye-bye.